Hi everyone, it's Gaban here again. It's June 22nd, 2010. Uh, just a really quick video uh, to bring you guys up to date with some stuff, let you know some new things I've just picked up and just some other general stuff that's going on. Uh, to begin with, we start with the uh, new toys I've picked up. I'll just rotate the camera. Right, so the first new toy I've picked up, uh, as you can see there, is Pro Protector on the Nintendo Entertainment System. Uh, I've been after this game for a while. Ever, um, Big Pro Protector fan. I've got it on the SNES, on the Game Boy, all the other consoles it comes out on. Um, never got around to getting the ones on the NES. Found this on eBay. Uh, comes with the manual. Also comes with the sheath. It's good condition. Fully worked. Like that. So that's great. Um, it's one of those games. It's not made available on Virtual Console yet. The second one is uh, of the NES games is available on Virtual Console, but the first one isn't. So it's one of those games. Really, I thought it was time to pick up. Uh, it was going cheap enough on eBay, and uh, well, it was going cheap enough on eBay, and I thought it was something to pick up and have, and you know, it was w worth doing. Um, so that's that one. Uh, recent, another thing I picked up recently is I went to a local car boot, um, I suppose you know, flea market, junk sale, something like that, um, in the local town, and picked up a Game Gear. This one here. Um, never had a Game Gear. Uh, because I was always a Nintendo fan, so I had the Game Boy. Uh, picked this up, works, it needed a good clean, it had been owned by someone who smokes. I'll just turn it on. Find it on my left hand. As you can see there, I'm going to to focus in a bit, so it's not so low, there you go. Audio does work as well. Um, there you go, Sonic on there, so I've got that. I'll just turn that back off again. Um, now that came with, so that came with the Game Gear, came with Sonic, which is in there already. Uh, it also came with this carry case. Now this is the um, Sega Game Gear ASCII wear carry case. Uh, strange enough, I actually have the um, the Game Boy version of this one. Um, it's designed to hold multiple games, chargers, magnifiers, Game Gear, spare batteries, all that sort of stuff. Uh, and I also got a collection of games along with Sonic. Um, I got Bart vs. the Space Mutants. Space Mutants. Two copies of George Film in uh, Kano Boxing. Uh, Columns, which everyone should get. Shinobi. Uh, World Class uh, leaderboard, Leadership Golf. Leaderboard Golf. Um, Streets of Rage. Uh, Joe Montana Football. And Alien 3. Um, again, all in good condition. I was surprised at the condition it was in after being uh, owned by a smoker. But the uh, games all worked. All had to have, all had to clean. I had to soak the cases for a little bit to make them turn out better. But I think they all turned out just as well. Uh, the other things I've just picked up, as you can see here, this is actually a T-shirt I've picked up from um, Hot Topic. Uh, for those of you in, in the UK who are fans of Hot Topic and have have had to either order stuff from abroad, from, from America. Um, Hot Topic has now set up a hottopic.co.uk site where you can uh, order stuff and they ship it pretty much direct. They don't have everything the American site has. It is a bit more of a limited selection at the moment. Hopefully they'll put more in there. But I thought I saw this on there. Nice uh, Andy Warhol style print of uh, NES controller. So I thought I'll get that. And I also got this really nice Batman Arkham Asylum t-shirt. Um, let me let us show you the whole print and on the back of there it's also got the Arkham Asylum logo there so that's really nice uh, so that's that flip this background um, okay sorry it's very hot this evening um, okay for you, those of you who have been tracking the feed you know that I've been doing collection videos I'm still working on them, I've got more to do. Um, I've got the Mega Drive one, don't worry, that wasn't me. That was just moving the case for the Game Gear. Um, I'm doing the, the uh, sorry, not Mega Drive, the Xbox One, uh, and I've still got the 360 and others to do. Uh, however, I recently did the one for the Mega Drive, um, I must say, the Mega Drive Saturn and Dreamcast. There was one game I knew I was missing off the collection for the Dreamcast, and I couldn't find it. I, f I have found it, it's Soul Calibur. Um, everyone knows about that. Brilliant game, you know. <laughs> Namco beat him up, you know, basically taking with weapons is always considered 
found that um, so I do have it so I may make a slight amendment to the video or by the time we get around to doing the, all the videos I'm sure I'm going to have other stuff that are out that are slightly missing from the list so I'm sure there'll be another video coming out at some point saying you know lost in it I mean, parts that have been missed and how they now they've been found um, the only other thing I wanted to mention um, not that obviously many of you guys are going to be interested in this but you know thanks first with me um, my cellular provider, my mobile phone provider, O2 in the UK, um, they have a, a service plan where for anyone who pays over £35 a month on a tariff gets what they call a bolt-on, which is a um, an add-on to your, your phone contract. They're varying ones. One of the ones they do is a bolt-on called unlimited internet, so unlimited web uses on your phone. Now that excludes tethering. We are talking purely internet use straight from the handset. Um, now it's unlimited with it was originally unlimited with fair usage policy however recently they've been whittling it down it's now down to 500 megs uh, unfortunately I've over the last two months been watching a lot of YouTube you know snares nares games console collection videos and I've happened to overrun so they've actually now blocked my uh, my internet usage of my phone so I have no internet usage of my phone um, obviously that's not going to cause too much of an issue. Doesn't mean anything. I've got to upload videos now. It pretty much waits until I can find a, either find a hotspot. You can see everyone a bit too close. Uh, until I can find a hotspot, or if I can find, um, you know, an internet cafe or something where I can plug a lap, plug my laptop up and uh, upload the video from there. Um, bit annoying. They won't reactivate me until um, my next term, till, till my next month bill goes out. Um, or if I wanted to, I could pay £30 extra a month to get uh, what they call a free gig tariff. Um, but that doesn't come as part of a Bolton, so I can't even get that discounted by the price of the existing Bolton I've got. Um, bit annoyed with that. Um, but hey, you know, this is what you get with cellular providers, mobile phone providers. They, they're all doing it. They're all, you know, charging you for data wherever they can, as much as they can. But that's, that's as much as that. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, I've got a couple of bits of things that I'm working on for the site, which will hopefully be coming up in the next couple of days. Um, I'm sure if anything goes on, hopefully I can get a couple more of the uh, collection videos done as well, get those up. I'm really hoping to get the Xbox One up by the end of this week at least. Um, if not, getting the, uh, that and some others up as well. I've got some nice, what I consider nice collections um, in the wing. Hopefully, um, when I come to one, there's a couple of more new surprises coming in that will hopefully be available, be around when I do the collection videos that weren't announced when I um, showed off the hardware in the initial video. We'll see about that. Um, so that's pretty much it. So again, as always, guys, see you later.